Hello, I'm Preparedness. We all like to think of our homes as a safe place, immune from the mayhem and mischief of disaster. Nice place. But he's out there, and he can drop by at any time. And the results of his visit can be devastating. Well, you can't always stop disaster's destruction from hitting home. Was a nice place. But by remembering these three things, you can keep your family safe. You need to know when to get down, get out, or seal up. When you're at home and disaster's working up some severe weather, you and your family need to be prepared to get down. It's not exactly what I had in mind. Go to the lowest level possible. A uh, basement or cellar is best and stay away from outside walls and windows. Stay under a support beam, a stairwell, or a heavy piece of furniture. If a basement isn't available, go to a small interior room, like a bathroom or a closet. In a mobile home, well, there just really isn't a safe place. So if you can't get to a sturdy shelter, then get out, get away from the trailer, and get down low to the ground. With a tornado or other storm event, Disaster comes and goes pretty quickly, but the destruction he leaves behind can disrupt things you count on. Have an emergency kit with things like food and water, first aid kit, important papers and contact numbers, flashlights with extra batteries, and a couple of ways to stay informed. Everything you need to care for your family for the first 72 hours after a storm. We've all seen the devastation that disaster can bring to unsuspecting doorsteps. Right, Dorothy? So listen, heed the warnings, and be prepared to get down. There's no place like home to be ready for whatever disaster brings. From tornadoes to terrorism, different emergencies, different responses. To put your plan together, go to preparemetrokc.org.